Hello and a very warm welcome to the beautiful city of Hong Kong. We are on the uh, South China coast on the eastern side of the Pearl River estuary for the 2018 Yonex Sunrise Hong Kong Open. Beautiful pictures here of uh, Victoria Harbour and um, I can tell you that this is uh, the 31st edition of uh, Hong Kong Open and as usual we're at the Hong Kong Coliseum. Magnificent arena on the Kowloon side of the city. It is uh, semi-finals day in this uh, Super 500 tournament, which is, of course is part of the HSBC BWF World Tour. Here we have the calendar. It's the 24th of 26 tournaments leading up to the year-end finale, the World Tour finals, due to be staged in three weeks' time in uh, Guangzhou. So here is um, our auto play for this first session of the day. We're covering all 10 semi-finals and um, we're starting out with uh, women's doubles and uh, last week's champions, former All England champions, Lee So He, that's only her, she and Sun Chan didn't win the All England. And, um, and the bronze medalist from this year's World Championships, Tanaka and Yonemoto, who um, won the all Japanese uh, quarterfinal yesterday. Then on to men's singles, the world champion Kenzo Momota against the former champion here in Hong Kong from 2014, Song Wan Ho. On to women's singles for the second consecutive um, year, Song Ji Hyun has made it to the semi final and uh, she's up against the former world champion Rachina Intanen. Then men's doubles, the 2016 champions Kamura and Sonoda is taking on the Asian Games silver medalist Alfian and Arianto. And the first session finishes with uh, the All England champions Watanabe and Higashino looking to reach their first finals since the uh, All England triumph. They are up against the surprise pair in this tournament, Li Yang and Su Ching of Chinese Taipei. So, a quick uh, look at the order of play for session two, starting um, later tonight, local time. Lots of interesting matches there as well, and of course, home interest with uh, the qualifier Li Chuk Yu making it to the semi final of the men's singles. And here's a chance to look at the uh, draw for women's doubles, as you can see. Li and Shin were the only pair that was uh, stretched to three games yesterday. A very, very entertaining match against Tsubajira Kurn and uh, Tera Chanachai from uh, Thailand. And uh, as I said, Tanaka and Yonemoto won the All Japan Affair against the Olympic gold medalist Matsutomo and Takahashi. It was only the second time that Tanaka and uh, Yonemoto managed to beat their compatriots. Welcome semi-finalists of women's double. Yeah, part of the draw, of course, uh, the world number ones, Fukushima Hirota, still in the tournament as uh, the players are marching on to the court. So he leading on the three other players of this um, semi-final. Shin Sung Chan again with uh, heavy strappings on uh, both her knees, knee support on right knee and uh, strapping on uh, the left knee as well. Korean women's doubles team have been really uh, hurt by injuries uh, here in 2018. But it's good to see them back and um, as I mentioned they uh, managed to win last year's uh, last week, sorry, Fujiao Super 750 tournament. So I'm here, John Lung and Indonesia Wayana is looking after the uh, services.
Daniel Emoto, of course, part of the gold-winning team in the uh, Uber Cup earlier on this year in Bangkok. You can see head-to-head -head is uh, one all between these two pairs. There's a little discussion, a, a meeting between Tanaka and uh, Yonemoto as to what they should select. I think they elected to serve. So, this uh, Shin Sung Chan is uh, from Ko uh, Chang Kung in Jolo uh, Pokto in uh, Korea. And, um, well, some years ago with um, Lee So Hee, they won the uh, Rolls in uh, the World Championships in uh, Copenhagen 2014, and then they uh, split up and played with um, other partners and uh, were very successful. By doing so, here Lee So He, who won the All England Championship in um, 2017 with Chang Yi Nat, uh, also in uh, Korea, and both players born in 1994. Shin. A little younger than uh, her partner. Here's the road to uh, the semi final. If you were with us yesterday, you would have seen a very entertaining uh, match against uh, Super Chirakul and uh, Tera Chanachai, where they had to come from a down, from a game down. The Koreans made some uh, excellent uh, tactical changes, assisted by, of course, experienced coach. Ra Kyung Min. Here's um, Kohara Yonemoto from uh, Hiroshima in Japan, of course. And, uh, 27 years of age. Ranked six at the moment, but um, as you can see, she's been as high as uh, fourth in, uh, on the World Tour ranking. Yeah, number 11th at the moment and will not qualify for the World Tour Finals. Here's a partner, Shio Tanaka. Tanaka, whose role in this women's doubles is mainly as the uh, backcourt player. Their best um, result this year is um, clearly the uh, bronze medal at uh, the World Championships in uh, Nanjing. Tough road to this semi final, they had to save three match points in the second round match against Chela Chalam and Muen Wong from um, Thailand. They were down 17-20 in uh, the decider before they came back to win it. And of course, um, a very good victory against uh, the Olympic gold medalist Taka Ashi and uh, Matsutomo. Yesterday, the second win over the Olympic gold medalist in uh, eight matches. Coaches Kei Nakajima and Shou Sasaki. Kohalu Yonemoto to serve to Li Shu He. Level play. Hey, hey. Left by uh, Yonemoto.
Great save by Yonemoto. Tried to go all the way across there. Something that the Koreans were very successful in doing yesterday against Super Chirakun and uh, Taylor Chanachai. Missed it, uh, Lee So he. on the opponent's back line. Locking that court for Lee So He. Who's uh, some of the Korean teammates supporting them. Very nice Seven shot over. from Shihu Tanaka. Just a little flick with the racket. Five, two. And then she let gravity do the rest. Stop the movement of the racket head totally there. And uh, begin an almost perfect shot. of the uh, device that's helping the service judge measuring whether the service is legal. Hey. Shuttle must be struck with all of it below 115 centimeters of height. Japanese uh, combination. Yeah, Yonemoto clearly the preferred front court player, whilst Shino Tanaka uh, is uh, taking the playmaker role from the back court. On the uh, Korean side, though, um, I think they're a bit more versatile. They can both play at the net. Oh, 
Too high. Service over. Just um, calling from Wayana. Need some heat. On the server, it's too high. Now, as I was saying, the Koreans a bit more versatile. Um, they can both uh, play the backcourt player role, and they can also both play the uh, frontcourt player role. I feel that Yonemoto might be the better frontcourt player of the four on the court, but um, we saw yesterday that it's very valuable to be uh, able to switch positions. Excellent shot. All right, Lee Sohi, very well placed that smash. Satisfied with herself there, Yonemoto. Excellent read. Sneaking Ten, seven. up on the front court there, Yonemoto. Thank you. Of course, one of the differences um, in front court player skills is how quickly do you sort of uh, noticed that there's a chance of um, a shot to the front court. How quickly do you notice that you can uh, move forward? Excellent play by Lee Sohi. Good awareness to uh, spot the gap there coming forward. Um, saw her miss a push earlier on uh, the back line. Clever play here by the Korean. Oh. 
Excellent uh, block in front of uh, Shio Tanaka. She oh, moves a little bit you. back. Tanaka, Play. out of respect for the possible push from um, Shin. Point lead for um, Tanaka and Yonemoto as we reach the mid game interval here in the first game. A chance for uh, the coaches to offer some advice. Interesting with the uh, Japanese coaches. Of course, Kei Nakajima, the uh, national women's doubles Play. coach, doing most of the talking, but uh, he was assisted by Sho Sasaki, the former international men's singles player from Japan. He's now coach with the Hokuto uh, Bank team, and that's where Tanaka and Yonemoto Play. is. Uh, Playing there, attached to um, that company team. Good way of spreading knowledge throughout the system, having um, assistant coaches at tournaments. Oh. What's she doing there, Yonemoto? Excellent uh, defensive shot by Yonemoto. time she was successful uh, Shin Sung Chan with the Seven cross four. drop 11 12 thank you she senses that Yonemoto has moved a little bit too far towards the middle of the court to help Tanaka cover in the defense Tricky playing conditions. There's a drift alongside the court coming from uh, Lee and Shin towards Inamoto and uh, Tanaka. <laughs> Yesterday we had shuttles that were quite slow and it was really difficult to uh, get correct length on, uh, especially the defense from this near side of the court. It seems like it's a little bit easier today. Good interception there by Inamoto.
Excellent. Power play by um, Shin and Lee. And by power play, I mean that uh, Shin can put so much pressure on the attack from the back court that uh, Lee so he can uh, commit almost entirely to the side where the attack is um, being placed. Good little deception on that return from uh, Shihu Tanaka. Starts with uh, a bit more speed in the racket and then um, just before impact reduces the speed and uh, makes the Koreans believe that it's going to be a long return. That one, you want a more top fourteen or it is her role in this um, combination to uh, take a little bit of bigger risk in her shot selection from the front court than um, Tanaka. Scores more points there as well. That stays in. 15-14. Shin and Lee won the last encounter between these two pairs. That was in uh, 2017 in uh, Denmark Open. that um, Li and Shin went on to win. Good deception again. Hey. What happened there? Service over. Did I miss uh, judgment or maybe it was directly in the lighting? Designated lighting, of course, for the center court here. Tanaka with the serve, not the most consistent server. That was a good one, though. See if um, Tanaka puts another deception on service return. Yeah, but this time uh, Shin didn't fall for it. Good shot. Not her preferred uh, position, Yonemoto, when she's on the back court. Confused because I thought earlier on it was that 
if the players needed to just quickly towel down, they could do so without asking the umpire. I felt that was implemented because of the rule that you cannot flick away Swift with your Seven palm on court. 16-18. Tension creeping in with the players here as we get closer to a conclusion of this first game. <laughs> Powerful display by uh, Shin Sung Chan. to me like she's the most powerful player on court at the moment in terms of uh, backcourt smashing. Ooh. That's a bad miss because that 20, was really... 20, game point 15. 20, game point 16. High. Low serve from uh, Shin. High low serve, not really accurate. Oh. Two misses okay. and uh, the Koreans, Lee Soo Hee, first Shin Sung Chan, takes the first Chan game. Chan, After being down 9 4, they came back and uh, took 21 16 after 22 minutes of play. So we're about to get the um, second game started here after the interval. Just getting the uh, court mopped. So it's safe for the players. Second game. Level. Of course, uh, advantage Play. to um, Shin yeah. and Lee after taking the first game. Powerful uh, display in. Um, Especially the attack. One love. The question is here, will it help Tanaka and Yonemoto that they're now playing a little bit uh, with the drift? It's not a little bit, they're uh, playing with the drift. Um, will it help their attack? Um, can Tanaka one. from the backcourt one match the four. power that um, we saw from uh, Shin in the uh, first game? and? Um, uh, Yonemoto cut down on the, the mistakes in the front court. That's going to be Two, key questions for the two Japanese players. From, um, last year's uh, 
year end finale that um, they won. And they beat Fukushima and Hirota in the final. They only won one other tournament, and that's the uh, India Open. Also an all Japanese final there where they beat Fukuma and Yunao. He's been uh, inconsistent in the, the defense, in my opinion, um, Kuharu Yunemoto. You can also see that she's sort of, after the rallies uh, concluded, she's trying out the uh, shots without uh, any shuttle, of course, but um, thinking a lot about her mistakes, it seems to me. Service was call too high. Service over. Three, two. So we saw yesterday that one of the solutions for the Koreans or the pair playing this near side of the court is to uh, push forward the defense and uh, work patiently over. Three, in the all. attack. Four, three. No. Oh, she almost got that back. She looks really, really strong, uh, Shin Sung Chan. One leg jump hey. there, and then getting back and uh, killing it. But <laughs> yeah, she, she thought as well that uh, it was a clear winner. Lady Tanaka with the kill on the front Service court. Over. That's not so often we see that. Four, five. Of course, she can play on the front court. I mean, all the top women's doubles pairs consist of players that can play both front and back court. But it's very often. One of the positions you prefer. Chuck replacement. Five all. She's really come back stronger, in my opinion. Shin Sung Chan after her injury period withdrew from um, they actually they retired in the first round matches of uh, Japan, China and the uh, Korea Open.
been a very, very good rally by all the players, but uh, eventually it's Seven, uh, five. Shin makes a difference. Longest rally so far, 46 shots, as uh, you can see. Getting the eyes at the exactly the correct level for the service judge Wayana from Indonesia. Service from uh, Lisa Heath. In the semi finals, we've got uh, dedicated umpires on that uh, service line. That was quite easy to see that it was nowhere near reaching the service line. seen her change because of her service problems change to um, forehand serve Shio Tanaka even a, a long forehand serve I feel that they look a little bit disheartened uh, Yonemoto and uh, Tanaka something drastically needs to happen for them to get back in this match I feel by uh, Shin, but uh, he wasn't Seven, uh, nine. totally uh, convinced that she would get this one, so she's covered behind her, and that leaves the court totally open. Play. So important in the Domus disciplines to uh, know what you're partner is going to do. Fault. Service over. Ten seven. Recognizing the different all the different situation that occurs in a match. The better or the more similarly the two players recognizes these situations, the better they play. Shin, they're playing so fast at the moment, and uh, now they have a four point lead here at the mid game interval. In the second game, Li and Shin one game up. Twenty seconds. 
20 seconds. Place on court. Eleven. So seven. She must be pleased, Ra Kyung Min, the Korean coach. She's won this Play. tournament three times herself, but never in the women's doubles. Always in the mix with uh, her now husband, Kim Dong Moon. Hey. <laughs> Indecision. I am Lee So He. I don't know if she touched it. I don't, s I don't see the linesman call that one. So long in that there was no need to. We're not in the best position here at the floor level, so I can't really see where that landed for the A boards. Rallies for Tanaka and Yonemoto here. So he has come undone. Meanwhile, she and Tanaka can uh, contemplate her next serve. Still has a chance of um, sweeping the titles in uh, Play. this tournament. And that's amazing since they've ever hey. only won one title here. That was Kamura and Sonora, whom we're going to see later on today. Won the tournament back in 2016, but uh, here at semi final stage, still with a chance to win all five disciplines. Hey. Service over. 12 9. Collected as always, Ra Kyung Min. Why shouldn't she be? <laughs> Simply too powerful, Shin Sung Chan. Nine. Even playing against the drift, and the motor not able to. Uh, Stand her ground in the defense, and already I feel that they're a little bit too far back in the defensive stance. If um, they want to be able to do something, I think they should 
move forward and, and try to block the shots instead of playing um, the long defense, block it and play the net court, Ten, uh, play the net area. 14. Please stay on court. Please stay on court. Thank you. Good placement there by Yorimoto. Play. There's the Japanese players, Takahashi and uh, Masatomo. Lost to Tanaka and uh, Yorimoto yesterday. Checking out the form of um, Shin and Lee. Look amazing right now. Oh. Perfect play by Lee, Lee Sohi and uh, Shin Sung Chan. leaving any possibilities open for um, Yonemoto and uh, Tanaka. 52 shots was that rally. Longest so far. Correction. Service over, 15-10. Yeah. Lee. Actually got the score wrong. Beginning. Our umpire, Jun Lung. Play. Oh, this is the correct one, 15 10. She hot, you said. Too quick there, and <laughs> so he Service over. missed that smash Level. completely. So from uh, Tanaka, it wasn't uh, that good a serve from Lee So He before that over. either. And 16, um, I can 11. tell you that, uh, as I mentioned earlier, you're situated on uh, floor level in this tournament here. It uh, doesn't really give the best of um, views to the court, but it gives a good view of the height over the net, which 17, sometimes um, disappear a little bit the higher. Um, you get and, and the uh, the picture you got there uh, makes it difficult to see how close to um, the tape the players are playing and I can tell you there's some possibilities for attacking the uh, service situation excellent drop shot again 